scoot this up. Okay, so I got Facebook here and I have YouTube right here. So give me one second. I am just going to share this to my pages and stuff. But, and I'll wait for just a few of you guys to get in here or at least just one. Okay. Yeah, so just wait for some people to get in here. We're gonna be talking about derma rolling tonight. I hope you guys are ready. It looks like I have one in each. So I have just, I don't know who's in here, but hello. So I have one right here, Facebook, YouTube. YouTube, Facebook. It's like both of my families are here. Um, I have some really cool news and stuff today, you guys. So I'm excited to share it with y'all as soon as I um, get this stuff together. So we will go ahead. Oh, somebody liked it already. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, hey girl. Hey. Okay. So um, let's go ahead and get started. So first, uh, let me adjust my camera here. I think I'm good here. Hello, it's the Lazy Snob. This is going to be a live tonight. We're gonna to be talking about derma rolling. Don't be scared now, girls. We're gonna do this derma rolling challenge. I hope you guys are ready. So um, make sure if you are watching this on YouTube or on Facebook, if you could just like this, like just, if you're watching it, just, just give me a like, okay? I'm kind of feeling myself today. Um, our channel, thank you. Oh, somebody gave me a heart. Our channel today, we got 6,000 people who bought into this. Like y'all, for real? <laughs> I can't believe it. So, um, oops, I forgot to share to one more group, sorry. So, um, I'm so excited, 6,000 people, really? Like, I couldn't believe it, I really couldn't. But at the same time, like, why not? Why, why not? So yeah, that is um, that is that. So if you are here, just make sure to like, if you are kind of like, just so happy to stumble upon this live and you're on YouTube, uh, subscribe. If you're on Facebook and you are watching this from the Facebook group, hello, hi Snob Squad. And if you guys are uh, familiar with the Facebook group or you wanna get into the Facebook group, um, the link will be in the description after I upload it and stuff. Um, so yes, make sure if you aren't subscribed to me on YouTube, because I already got 6,000, we might as well get to, can we get to 7,000 tonight? You guys think that's possible? Uh, make sure to like this video, obviously, um, subscribe and then hit the notification bell so I can spam you guys. Like I want to spam you. So, um, without further ado, um, oh wait, aside from that, so, uh, the Facebook group, and also follow me on Instagram, Pinterest, all of that stuff. And I also have a mailing list. And the mailing list is uh, through my website, right? So www.lazystime.com. And that one, I want you guys to sign up because I'm going to start doing exclusive. Hi. Hey, guys. That's my Facebook group. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put Facebook and YouTube together. We're going to see if we can get some more people in this YouTube one, okay? Because the YouTube people, they're not used to seeing me live. So... Um, I want you guys to sign in, sign up for my website. Like seriously, I'm going to have some newsletters for you guys, some exclusive giveaways, some exclusive, um, blog content as well. Actually, I'm going to say that for the end. I got some really exciting news for you guys, but your girl, she's been working. Okay. I've been working. So, um, Make sure, if you guys are watching this on a replay, make sure to look in the description box because everything that I'm going to be talking about is going to be in the description box, okay? So let's go ahead and um, jump in it. So today we're gonna to be talking about derma rolling. Uh, put a one in the comments if you guys derma roll before or if you've been interested in derma rolling. I wanna see it. Show me something, you guys. So um, for me, I've uh, been derma rolling for several years now. Um, I like it. It has a lot of benefits and stuff. And I want to share those with you guys, obviously. Give me one second. I'm just adding this um, to a group. Okay. We'll forget about that. Let's just go. So there's a lot of benefits of derma rolling. Um, 
One, it's better for product absorption, right? So, you know, your skin is already very absorbent, but when you're derma rolling, you're basically making microscopic um, wounds to your skin. So you're basically messing up your skin to for it to repair itself. Um, and micro needling is another term for it. And so with the micro needling process, um, you are, it's going to uh, produce collagen. So the process on its own is strong enough for you to not have to use any other products with it. But in this one, I am going to be using some serums after I derma roll. So um, derma rolling will help with skin discoloration. If you have texture on your skin, if you have large pores, which was always my problem because I have oily skin. Um, if you have large pores, if you have um, wrinkles, signs of aging, age spots, acne scars. I had acne scars here um, that I've been working on for quite some time. Um, but it's also going to just improve your skin texture and overall make you have that dewy, gluey, beautiful glow. And we all want that for when we come out of quarantine, right? So, um, yes, microneedling techniques to increase your collagen production. Um, and collagen, just a fun fact, is like, that's the most abundant protein in your body. So with collagen, um, that's why so many products like skincare products have collagen in it. And you guys know I love collagen infused products. Like collagen is really good for stuff. If you guys um, are also interested in seeing a video on how I derma rolled my stretch marks, I went back and looked. Oh, hearts, love you guys too. <laughs> um, I made a video probably this time last year and I saw my results the other day because I, I just so happened to stumble across the footage and I was like, oh my God, like this derma rolling thing actually works. So, um, yeah, so basically you're making tiny scars on your skin, like tiny wounds on your skin, and your skin's just going to repair itself because that's what your, ten, your skin is. It's the largest organ in your body, so you might as well take care of it. So, um, now we're going to talk about the sizes and stuff. So, if you guys are in the Facebook group, if you aren't in the Facebook group, you need to be in the Facebook group, but this is the one that we decided to go with for our May challenge where we will be derma rolling um, doing a derma rolling regimen. I'll get into that. So this one, I'll use this one as an example. So we got several, um, several different options here. So this is the head, like this is, or I'm sorry, not the head. This is like the base of it. And it is, you can just take it off and use the different, uh, sizes. So this one I can tell, I'm going to show YouTube first. Sorry guys. Sorry, Facebook. Hold on. So this size is the 0.25, um, please focus, please focus, come on camera, the 0.25 um, mm. This one, okay, let me go, sorry Facebook. Y'all, I'm treating Facebook like the stepchild because I have two cell phones, right? I have two phones and I'm using like my old phone for Facebook, sorry. <laughs> I love you guys, but you know, that's why the camera quality is, completely different on one. So this is the 2.25 mm. That one you'll want to use if you have enlarged pores. Um, if you want to improve your skin texture, that's good enough. Um, as well as hyperpigmentation and skin discoloration. You should be good with that. Um, now, this one probably has about 800 needles in it. Let me double check. This is the box that it came in. This one, oh, 720 needles. I was close, 720 needles on this one. 720 needles. And a lot of people ask if it hurts. No, no and yes. So if you're using a um, 0.25, no, you'll be fine. You should be fine. Um, YouTube keeps moving a little bit, I don't know. Okay, Facebook. So um, we also have this one. This is about 1,200, 1200 needles. And this size is a 0.3. This one also is going to fall in that, that category of enlarged pores. You got skin texture problems. This is for you. Um, hyperpigmentation, discoloration, but you can get a larger area with this one. It should, it's like the same size, basically. Showing you guys too. It's the same size, basically. Um, just a little bit larger of an area that you can cover. So that... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just laughing at the comments. Sorry. Okay. So this one, we have this one now. This one is 300 needles. And this one's a 0.25. So 
So this one, this is what all prompted it, right? I wanted my luscious, juicy lips. So I was like, I'm gonna start a derma rolling challenge and I want everybody to join in that, that want to do it, but don't be scared. Don't be scared, it does not hurt. 0.25 is not gonna hurt you. This is the 0.25, I hope the camera is focusing um, for you guys, but it's 300 needles. This is perfect for derma rolling the lips. And um, this also came with the silicone brush, which I'm gonna, I have, I have something to tell you guys. Honestly, the best thing that you can use to like um, wash your skin with is your hands. Like you really shouldn't be using those little makeup brushes and those, especially those scrub brushes. Like, oh, oh my God. I have a thing with manual exfoliation. I'll get into that one day maybe. I'm, I'm really weird about manual exfoliation now. I'm definitely into peels and chemical treatments, but you gotta be careful doing those at home. It gets a little crazy. So, um, well, actually I'm gonna keep this out. So most of these, this one, you, this is safe to use at home. Like you can use this at home. Now, when you're talking about the larger size, so if you have um, larger acne scars or if you have like really deep acne scars, um, you wanna start with the 1.0 mm. Start with the 1.0 mm um, so that it can get a little bit deeper. So basically the mm's are um, the how deep the needle is. So a 0.25 is very, very, very small. Oh, thank you, hello. Thank you for joining in on the live, hey. Um, so um, I got this one from Amazon. I'll link it in the description box after the live. I'm gonna save my lives now because I wasn't saving them before because I was embarrassed, but who cares? Um, so the needle size is how deep, how deep the needle is basically, the MM. So the MM on um, these, safe to use at home, you're good. Now when you're talking about trying to get rid of like stretch marks, like the one that I was using is like a 1.5. Um, when you get to 2.0, like that's the one, like you probably want to consult with your local, your friendly neighborhood esthetician to make sure you can really use that at home. Um, I would start, if you are looking to derma roll stretch marks, that's probably another, a whole nother video. That one, um, I would suggest a 1.5 mm and up, but I did notice results and I'm going to have to like edit the video and get some more content for you guys on that. So um, how often do you derma roll? It depends on what size you use. So we got the 0 0.25, 0 0.25 is all in here up to 0.3, right? So these I can use as often as one, one to two times a week. I'm going to start out with two times a week because I've been derma rolling for quite some time. I've been derma rolling for, for a long time, but so if you are going with a 0.25, you can do this every other day. Okay, okay, I'm seeing some comments about people wanting the stretch mark video. Okay, I think, yeah, that needs to be shared. That definitely needs to be shared, okay, before quarantine is up. So um, 0.25 mm's, you can use that every other day. So that one I I'm probably gonna do for my lips. I'm gonna do that every other day. Um, if you're using 0.5 mm or less, um, that one we are going to want to um, only use that once a week, especially if you're just um, just getting into derma rolling because your skin will be sensitive the day after. Like your skin is going to be a little sensitive. That's normal. Um, so if you're using a 1.0 mm or less, that one um, I would only do once a month. Once a month. When I do my stretch marks, I was doing it once a month. But that was, I worked my way up to that. And then we have 1.5 mm. That one is like every six weeks. So um, that one, I, I was pushing it with the stretch marks doing it. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I was doing it once a month because I, I was like, I wanna see if it works. And I did notice improved. So it depends, I think it depends on the kind of stretch marks you have too. It depends on how deep they are, but it definitely improved the overall texture of them. They're a lot like slimmer now, if that makes sense. So um, yeah, like to know it, hashtag like to know it. So um, yeah, so let's say we are getting ready to start derma rolling. The first thing you're gonna wanna do is, now I told you guys, I told y'all, you heard this from me, 
that I don't like to personally have a, um, I don't like using implements or um, the best thing you can use to wash your face is your hands. Okay, let me not say I don't like to use that stuff. I'm just going to wet my face up a little bit. And I'm using like this reusable microfiber towel um, that I have. Um, my girl, she's in the Facebook chat. I will link her description to her website where you can get these towels. Um, you know who I'm talking about. I'm not going to say your name because I'm on two different platforms. Um, can they buy these? Because I, I need some more. I, I need some more of these. You know who I'm talking to. You know, you know who you are. Just let me know. And I'm going to use a, a water-based cleanser. The best thing to use again, and I'm just going in and kind of getting it a little bit wet. If you guys have a foam cleanser, that's probably even better. Um, normally, also, another thing I've been learning is that uh, you do want to wash your face for at least like 60 seconds. It's a 60 second rule. So, yeah. Definitely good to know. It is good to know. Um, so yeah, wash your face with a water-based cleanser. And you probably want to wash with your hands. I just have a little bowl off, off to the side that I'm using. Um, it's better to use your hands, but for, for this, I'm just going to use my little microfiber towel. And kind of wipe off. Now, uh, another thing is what I did off camera before I got on this live was I used this alcohol. This is 90%, okay? This stuff ain't no joke. This is 90% isopropyl alcohol to um, sterilize my, my implements. And when I say implements, I mean the derma, the derma roller head. So, um, moving this out of my face. I got this little headband from Amazon, even though it's like, it feels like it's hardly working. So, hey, 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 where have you been? Okay, so let me go ahead. And now I'm going to get my derma rollers. So like I told you guys, I let it soak in alcohol like this little bowl, I just kind of let it soak in there for a little bit, um, and then you let them dry. So I, you can also keep that for after you are done, when you're wrapped up um, from using your derma roller, and you can let it um, sit out. But this one came with a really cute, I've never seen a, a case like this before. This is fancy, this is really nice. Quarantine it, I know, it, the struggle is real. We are all in the struggle bus. So. Let's start. Let me do this. Y'all ready? Okay. So I'm going to do the 0.25. Um, I could use a larger head, but I only soak this one. So um, I like to separate my face. I think of my face like this, like a grid like this. Okay. Start section here, section there, section there, section there. Um, for this, for the purpose of this live, I'm just going to do this part. Um, so I start up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. That's four times. Side, side. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. Four times. Y'all can count. Diagonal. One, two, three, four. And the other side. One, two, three, four. And you repeat it all throughout your face. It's worth it. It seems like a lot, but honestly, it would go faster if I was like, you know, kind of speeding up. I made you do all of this off camera, but you get the point. So after you're done with your face, um, keep in mind the one thing I will tell you guys, do not think of this is like, this is called your, um, I think it's called your or, orbital eye socket, like your eye socket area. Do not. Do not do this part. I'm looking at you, YouTube. I'm looking at you, Facebook. Do not. Do not do this part. Um, skip over that. Just do this, this, this. You can do your nose as well. Here and here. Do not. 
do that part. It's very, very sensitive. So after you're done with that, um, remember, you can go to sleep. Like you could just, you know, go to sleep after this. I would suggest if you aren't going to apply any, um, any, any serums or anything afterwards or any essences, you can uh, wash your face one more time and then um, just with water, nothing else, just water, and then go to sleep because you are essentially, you are making wounds on your face. You're, you're making tiny, tiny little wounds on your face. So keep that in mind. I'm gonna put this in the, the alcohol, you guys, because I don't want it to get nasty. So um, after you guys do that, you are going to, um, you can either go to sleep just like this. The one thing I will say is no, um, let me find it. I'm gonna show you the example of what not to use on your face. So the things that you can use on your face, things like this, like uh, essences and um, collagen, uh, very gentle serums, maybe even like a facial oil. Let me show you what you will not be using, which, um, okay, the, the product that you're not supposed to use, I didn't even bring it down because you're not supposed to use it, right? Retinol, Retin-A, avoid stuff like that. Also avoid um, peels, like anything that will make your skin irritated because this, the derma rolling, especially if it's your first time, your skin is going to be irritated. You're gonna be a little irritated. So just keep that in mind. Do not use any any products that, basically any products that you can't go out in the sun in, if you can't go outside in the sun and you know without putting on 100% SPF, do not put it on your face. So we're gonna only stick with our collagens, our serums, our very gentle, very gentle stuff. Don't no retinol, nothing like that. You will want to use, um, you can use eye creams. I think that's good because you will be avoiding this area. You will not be doing this area. So you can use eye creams. You can use um, eye creams. Uh, some people, after they do the derma rolling, sometimes they put uh, the Korean skincare mask on too. Um, so you could do that too. I think anything like that, but just avoid. I can't keep saying this enough because one time I made this mistake and it was not. It was not pretty. Okay, so are you guys ready for my little surprise? <laughs> you guys waited this long. You might as well just hear this surprise. So it will be obviously in the description box, but your girl is an author now. Like I literally made an e-guide for you guys to follow with a derma rolling. Cue in the claps, yay, <laughs> yay. Okay, so um, yes, and the ebook, the e guide is 100% free for a limited time. So if you guys are interested in that, I will link it in the description. I'm gonna save this slide. If you're on YouTube, it's going to be in the description box as as always. Hey, thank you. Yes, clapping emojis. Clap, 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 clap. <laughs> Round of applause. Okay, thank you, thank you. Yes, so. Um, it will be in the description box if you're on YouTube. If you're on Facebook, I'm going to link it. I'm going to change the description. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I'm going to change the description to show that, but I'm also going to, maybe I'll link it. Um, maybe I'll pin it to the top of my page. I'm going to pin this live to the top of my page on Facebook. Um, on Instagram, you guys probably not on Instagram. I'm not on Instagram live, but I'll have a, I'll make a separate post on Instagram live. I'll make a separate post. And yeah, if you guys are really interested in, um, getting the little guide, it's just a quick little, little, little quick guide for you guys to follow, because I know this was a lot of information. So I think it was be an easy way, but I'm going to have some more little guides and stuff coming for you guys. Like I'm going to make some really cool stuff, which is why you need to join my mailing list. Can you join my mailing list? Can you guys do that for me? <laughs> join my mailing list so you guys see all the stuff that I do behind the scenes. I redesigned my website. I did a whole bunch of stuff. So I'm so excited for all of us. Thank you. Thank you to everyone who literally got this channel to 6,000. I know it's like not a big deal, but it's a big deal to me. It's a really big deal. So 
Um, thank you guys on Facebook for, what is it, like 700 plus likes. That's pretty cool. And the group is growing too. Um, I'm really, really excited for you guys to see the e-guide. And just let me know what you guys think. And you guys can share it, you know, with your friends and family. And yes. So I will be uh, linking. It is a big deal. Okay. Thank you. I will be linking the uh, the stuff that I use today, the description, as well as the e-guide. You guys can get that. So it will be available tonight. Okay? So I enjoyed having you guys here. It's like having my YouTube and my Facebook peeps right here. So I will see you guys in the next one. I think my next video I'm going to do is going to be like, let's do... I think I'm going to do like a swimsuit haul or something. I need to go through my swimsuit drawer. So I'm thinking about uh, posting that video on Friday night. Yeah, let's do that video Friday night. We're going to do the swimsuit drawer. So um, yes, if you guys are on Facebook and you aren't subscribed to me on YouTube, please do that right now. If you guys are in YouTube or on YouTube and you already subscribed, but you're not in the Facebook group, I'll wait. Okay, so I will see you guys in the next one. I feel like I've been talking long enough. Thank you guys so much for being here and love y'all, love y'all, love y'all. Y'all made my day today. Ah! Okay, bye.